the effects of drought in Kenya. Economic. Kenya had to appeal for £85 million worth of aid and they had dying farm, farm animals, meaning they can't get money from uh, milk, etc. Uh, failing crops and food prices increased. The social effects include more than 11 million people in the Horn of Africa who were affected by famine, and that's a million in Kenya. There was a lack of clean drinking water. The local markets had no food. Malnutrition due to lack of variation in food supply. School attendances have dropped and there's been begging. Um, uh, the demographic effects of refugees, uh, the camps are over full due to drought and military conflicts. Uh, the political response, drought declared as a national disaster and the Salvation Army installed over 200 water tanks that can store 500 litres of water. Social impacts, crop failure for farmers turning the farmers are turning to poorly paid quarry work. Massa cow people can't herd anymore as cows can't survive. Economic crop crop failure, cattle dying and loss of economic trade. Uh, environmental droughts, lack of water for animals and and people, lack of water for plants so no harvest can occur. Thirty two people killed in armed robbery in order to gain money for food. Thirty eight mil 38 million people required for food in Kenya. The social effects are disputes between users of available natural resources and its parities in relief assistance. Economic effects include declining crop yields and livestock implies a reduction in income for farmers, those with economic ties to it and an increase in the market price of products. Acute lack of water and pasture results in livestock and wildlife losses and bad road conditions hamper market access. Environmental effects are the increased pest and diseases, soil erosion, habitat and landscape degradation, a decrease in air and water quality and increased risk of fires. Demographic, demographic effects are affected the livelihood of 9.5 million people and political response or influence as the USNID said it may worsen security in the region and UNICEF and other organisations provided food and water for thousands. Uh, demographic effects include 14 direct deaths and 4 million Kenyans facing starvation. More people were left in poverty conditions as well as those already left in poverty conditions. Uh, Environmental effects include falling water table, desert, uh, desertification and potential salinisation. Uh, the available water was low and became polluted. Social effects include people feeling abandoned from being left homeless and bereaved. Overall health depletion and poor security of the water supply. Economical effects include less production and no crops or greenland which is seen as income, a source of income. Lots of damage costs, spread of disease, healthcare healthcare costs, government provide relief food, a cost on natural budget. Yeah. Um, short term impacts of drought, social effects, starvation, dub uh, more children get malnutrition, uh, measles and diarrhoea, uh, desperate search for water and pasture will intensify clashes, livestock raids, uh, banditry and social unrest, um, education, children, schooling affected by distance and poor performance, economic effect, crop failure, no money due to the lack of plant growth, 70% of livestock loss, no income for farmers, increase in market price for, pro for products, um, lack of water, so livestock and wildlife loss, isolation, no access for transport and bad roads, Environmental effects, 70% loss of livestock, disease and air, water quality de decrease, increase of fires, maize crops under moisture stress, dry riverbeds, no water for elephants, um, shared water sources for humans and animals, untreated water and long walks and uh, treks. Um, demographic effects, 40,000 children and women need life-saving and help. Um, political response influences 1.2 million received food aid and could 
and could raise for 2.5 million UNICEF vaccination, development of water supplies, education of agricultural techniques. There's a widespread famine. Measles broke out, 462 cases confirmed, 11 deaths. Dehydration caused by insufficient liquid intake. Diarrhea caused by microorganisms and contaminants in water. Contaminated water caused cholera, which led to widespread illness. Rivers dried out, which led to soil erosion, which lasted for months when it started raining again. And there's an increase in the spread of waterborne diseases. US NID said the region may worsen. UNICEF and other organisations provided food and water for thousands of people. Now we're going to look at the long term. I'm going to start with Ben. The long term effects of drought in Kenya. Uh, economic food prices increased. Uh, social, it took at least seven months for families to recover. And things like water tanks were installed in order to prepare people for future droughts. Environmental, with lakes dried up and soil lacks nutrients. Although it rained, it takes a long time to build up water level so drought becomes very persistent. Demographic, children lack education due to lack of money in the families and also in the schools. Political response, there was the Salvation Army International Emergency Team. Social Kenyan nomads and herders struggle to maintain traditions so they have to change and live off government. Economic, no livestock, no money. Um, have to migrate to find money to provide food for their families. Environmental, little food for wild animals. Elephants malnourished, so die of illness. No water source for animals and plants, so animals will die of, as a result. Um, demographic, no, res no rainfall for two years. Rainfall below 1,000 millimetres for um, 2,000 millimetres in highlands. Um, two th in 2001, Kenya spent um, one, 140 million on relief food. Hundreds of families moving. A four consecutive rain seasons failed. Um, 2009, worst in two years. Over 7,000 cattle arrived in Nairobi um, to provide food for them. 1,500 died. Um, Four failed harvests and electric cut to be switched off because it couldn't be paid for. Political response: charities such as UNICEF provide aid. One, uh, 140 million spent by government for aid and food. The social effects include separation of families, may occur due to migration causing food insecurity, malnutrition, and increased mortality. Desperate search for water and pasture will intensify. Clashes, livestock raids, banditry and social unrest, education, children, schooling affected distance and poor performance. Economic effects are unemployment of farmers and retailers, diversion of development funds to emergency and increased poverty and malnutrition. Environmental effects are that natural environments fail to rebound Plant and animal species can suffer tremendously, and desert desertification. Demographic effects are worst drought in Kenya in 60 years, 1.3 billion dollars in relief, and 50 to 60 thousand deaths. Political response or influence: United Nations officially declared famine in two regions. UN's appeal of 2.5 2.5 billion, 350,000 homes built in somewhere but people came severely crowded uh, demographic effects were poverty increases furthermore um, low income breakouts of conflict and war and lives are at risk of forest fires environmental effects were the spread of forest fires as mentioned which puts more lives at risk as well as deforestation uh, social impacts were uh, spread of disease and pandemics breaking out and the people can't cope with further droughts. Um, economic effects for loss of livestock and the amount and therefore the productions. Uh, inflation and less food, which means less food and availability is at higher cost. Um, social effect, lack of water and sanitation, 
disease, inequalities in resources alloc all allocation or access, decline in health, poor sanitation, increase in poverty, death rate increases, migration, so food insecurity, malnutrition again, um, increase in rate of mortality, economic effect, four, 426 million to provide human humanitarian assistance, unemployment of farmers and retailers, division of development funds to emergency, increased poverty and malnutrition, soil erosion, no, environmental effects, soil erosion, temperature increase, depletion of surface and ground resources, increased pest disease and soil erosion, landscape degradation, um, desertification, um, in extinction of plants, animals and species, demographic effect, death rate increase in due to poverty, malnutrition and disease, uh, political response, no help, targeted feeding programmes increase, um, $80 million emergency health care, improve the effectiveness of response mechanisms. Other long-term social impacts were severe malnutrition leading to a large number of deaths. 920,000 refugees from Somalia fled to neighbouring countries becoming displaced. 80% of women and children became displaced. 1.8 million children under the age of five are now in need of humanitarian assistance in the Horn of Africa. Economic long-term impacts are Large quantity of livestock died, therefore farmers weren't able to make the livelihood. Kenya appealed for $150 million in foreign aid to help save lives. Livestock that survived were vulnerable due to the low quantity of food and water, and so were weak and struggled to provide milk and also food. Rivers dried out. 8.8 .8 million people were in need of water. Climate change, both locally and regionally, due to, this, due to the rain seasons, have changed. There was a loss of biodiversity and soil erosion due to the soil drying out. Demographic impacts. There was the worst drought in Kenya in 60 years, calling people to be displaced and migrate to a new home. It affected the livelihood of 9.5 million people, causing gender inequality. $1.3 billion was given in relief. 50 to 60,000 people died. Droughts and, farm and famines can have other geographical impacts. If drought forces people to migrate to a new home, it could put pressure on resources in neighbouring countries. Political responses then, in the long term, the UN officially declared famine in two regions. The UN appealed for $2.5 billion worth for aid. 350,000 homes were built in Dia Dia, but people came and were severely crowded.